Nice job, Henry. Of course. I told you to give us the dough, didn't I? How come you know the Bible so good, Henry? You read it or something? Bruno always uses the same quote. I go to church on Sunday, so I asked the priest one time. You go to church? <laughs> yeah, and I can understand why you don't. They use big words, there's no hookers, and the fool's lousy. Yeah, that pretty much sums it up. Jeez, I ain't been there since... 45. What? That time your mother made you go to confession? Yeah, that time she smacked me for checking out some chick's cool. Ah, I got rest of soul. How about you, Joe? How long's it been? Easter. Ah, that ain't too bad. 1941. I take that back then. You're going straight to hell. What, you just figuring that out now? Don't worry, I'll save seats for the both of these. You know, I heard about a loan shark named Bruno once. Must be the same guy. Yeah, what'd you hear? Well, you know Mickey the Crab, right? What, the guy who cleans the bathrooms at Carlos joint? Yeah, the guy who's only got a finger and a thumb on his left hand. Guess how that happened? I heard he owed a lot of money to some yid from Southport. You get my drift? Oh, right, I get the picture. Haha, <laughs> don't worry though. Crab's a moron. Not like that's gonna happen to us. Hey, genius. Red light means stop. All right, we're almost there. Drive through the gate and into the yard. All right, follow me, fellas, and let me do all the talking. Hey, somebody order a pizza? Hey. We got some business with your boss. Greetings, Mr. Tomasino. Welcome, Henry. Hello, Mr. Wang. Let us get straight to business. Is your suitcase heavy enough? See for yourself. Hell, Da, this is a of Earth Yuan Mei Jin Cao Piao. It costs three thousand five hundred yuan. All right, take it away and bring the goods. You're a good man, Henry. Here is your merchandise. Each bag contains one kilo. Each kilo weighs a little more than two pounds. Which one do you want to test? Okay, we're good. I'm glad. Next time, we can give you twice the amount. It was a pleasure doing business with you, Mr. Wang. The pleasure was all mine. Knock it off. See how easy that was? Let's get back in the car. Alright, fellas, the hard part's over. Now we just gotta make the exchange and we're done. Sounds good to me. Where are we headed? Hunters. I got it all lined up. Hello, gentlemen. Fucking sick. I think you have something for us. Drop the suitcases. Hmm. 
my shoes. Wait a minute, these guys ain't cops. Kill the bastard! Shoot, Vito! Vito, watch our back. <clears throat> Way to go, Vito! Here comes more of them! Hold on. I got him. Bingo! Nice! But there's still too many of them. Come on! Stay away from these windows, fellas. Damn it, Vito! No sense Take staying that. up here. Let's get down there. These guys just don't fucking learn. Get down! Uh, he's mine. Oh. Oh. You okay? We'll get him. Hey, I got something for Come you. Come on, think of something. Hurry up here. Ah, oh, you're not completely fucking useless. Is that the fucking best yeah. you got? Uh oh, you're in trouble. I got you covered, Vito. Move. I'm back. Shit, you're right. Take a lot more than that. He's over there! Friends ain't gonna help you now! Going in! Stay sharp, Vito. You shoot like my sister. Shoot him! All right, Vito, go, go, go! Okay. Is he? Stay sharp, Vito. <laughs> all right, Vito, go, go, go. you got? Come on, fuck you. Yeah, bring it on. Is that the fucking Good best shoot. you got? Oh, Help me out here, fellas. Let's go, Vito. Take him out! Oh, oh. This is gonna make Got him! Famous. Shit! 
me out here. Bring it on, motherfucker! Trying to kill us or what? Jeez, relax, Shit. will you? That was fucking close. It's not over yet. They're coming after us. Fuck, lose them. He's mine. Oh, they got him. Shot. Bring it on, motherfucker. I'll cut you. Move. Oh. You all right? Take a lot more than that. I'm back. Ah, uh, that was a red light, you know. What the fuck was that, Henry? No idea. Somebody else must have known about the deal. Those definitely weren't real cops. Maybe it was the chinks trying to fuck us. I doubt it. Look, I'll figure it out. But first, we gotta unload this stuff. Vito, take us to the old warehouse in Hunters. All right. Hope this deal goes better than the last one. It will. Not like it can go any worse, right? So who are we selling this stuff to? A bunch of different guys. Oh, whoa, whoa. What do you mean a bunch of different guys? A bunch of different guys. What did all that shooting back there make you deaf? I thought you said we were just moving this garbage from one place to another. Yeah, well, you make a lot more money if you sell it in smaller amounts. Would have been really nice to know before I agreed to go in on this. If I did, from the way you were talking back in the park, you probably wouldn't have. Yeah, exactly. Hey, the best you could hope for right now is to spend the next 30 years of your life breaking your ass for Eddie and Carla before you either get bumped off or end up back in the can. The only time you're ever going to see cash like this is if you stick your neck out. Besides, I ever steer you wrong. Well, there was the OPA job. And that time we almost got killed when we whacked that fat fucking sand island. All right, all right, enough. None of that matters after today. Let's just get the hunters. And don't worry, we're never gonna have to see these scumbags again after today. Unless this turns into a regular thing for us. Well, all right, let's just concentrate on getting through this one before we go making plans like that, all right? Hey, I'm just saying. Vito's right. Let's just get through the rest of the day. After that, smooth sailing, fellas. Here we are. Let me do the talking. These are tough guys, so no wise-ass comments. All right, Joe? Hey, guys, how you doing? Hey, man. Come on in. <coughs> Shit! It smoke! Oh, fuck! <coughs> We did it! We hit the jackpot! Hey, 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 take it easy. We're not done yet. Lighten up, will you, Henry? What's the matter? All of a sudden, money don't make you happy? After we pay back Bruno and you get your cut, then you could be happy. All right, all right.
You ain't even gonna give me a tip? You want a tip? I'll give you a tip. Don't let the door hit you in the ass on the way out. Always the gentleman, <laughs> huh, Joey? <laughs> Just get the fuck out of here hey, already. Gina, wanna come join me? Hey, I hope there's room for three in there. Barbaro's Bordello. You got the money, we got the honeys. Vito, it's Henry. We got a problem. What kind of problem? Eddie paid me a visit. Carlo knows about the deal, and he sent Eddie to pick up his cut. Uh, how much? Sixty grand. Fuck, how much? What are we gonna do? I don't know. We don't even have enough left for Bruno. Meet me in the park. I don't want to talk about this over the phone. Okay. I'll be right there. Joe, we gotta go. What? What for? Now, Joe. I'll tell you on the way. Henry's different these days. The guy's got a real... What the, what the fuck? fuck's going on? <laughs> Shit, that's Henry! <laughs> what the fuck are they hitting him with? Get on me! Fuck! Who the fuck does something like this, Vito? Them people are fucking sick. Shit! Who the fuck does something like this? Who do you think? Look at this, Vito. You fucking believe this? Yeah, the money's gone too. Joe, come on. We gotta get out of here. Cops will take care of Henry. Hey, 
Hey, that's the old guy who sold us the dope, Wong. Of all the ways to kill a guy, a goddamn bullet would have been enough. These bastards are sick in the head, Vito. They're gonna fucking die. All of them. I mean, why do it like that? And in the middle of the park. Like I said, they're sick. I'm gonna turn them into chop fucking suey. Hey, not for nothing. We don't even know how many of them there are. Yeah, and it don't matter. Hey, Henry's dead. What, do you want us to get killed too? We gotta do this smart, Joe. It don't matter how we do it. As long as they're fucking dead when we're done. All right, listen. There's probably more than two of them. So what? The more, the fucking merrier. So there's only two of us. Unless maybe you want to call Carlo and tell him all about the mess we're in asking to send some guys over here. All right, fine. I get it. All right, so promise me you're not gonna go in guns blazing as usual? We gotta do this the smart way, all right? Now we know where to find him. Let's get in there and take him out before he disappears with the money. Hold on, I'm gonna need some serious firepower first. We can either go to Harry's or we can kill these fucks right now. Just say the word. Gentlemen, this place for member only. Here's your fucking membership. Thing. God damn it, Joe. Can't you listen to me for once? No, I can't. You seen what they done to Henry. God damn it, Joe. You see? Why didn't you distract the damn gun while you were at it? Pipe down! Look at the asshole behind the bar! Koi san, kuya batong! Koi san do, lei bing do! Koi san! Koi la! Watch out! They shoot from up top! Is he done? <laughs> Say good night, Jolly Jim. Come on, Vito, let's move up. Get the guy on the stairs. Right, there's three more of them. <laughs> you ain't so tough. Two more to go, and that's it. Come on, Vito, let's move up! Where the, the fuck, fuck are they all go? coming from? Must be a tunnel to China around here somewhere. 
Come on, Vito! Waste them all! Watch out, here comes more of them! Koyak no! Why? Don't go! Go go Hakatan! This is for Henry, you bastards! Alright, you go first, Vito. You're a smaller target. Thanks. That is. Hey, you Die, said we you gotta go smart, right? Oh, they don't go. Big mistake. <laughs> Come on. Who taught you assholes how to shoot? The wrong guys, dick you. Where the hell is that prick? He's Come gotta on, be around Mr. here somewhere. Big man. Let's keep going. This is for Henry, you bastards. Come on, you little fucks. How many more they got back there? Don't matter. I got plenty of bullets left. Oh, they have That's it, Vito. Kill them all. Every last one. <laughs> How'd that feel, huh? Come on, let's go, Vito. Get in the elevator. Shh! Be quiet, Vito. Since when are you concerned about making noise? There's too many of them. Just take them out nice and quiet. Let's just sneak through here.
the last of them. See? Ain't so bad so far, right? Yeah, but what if somebody recognizes us and Carlo hears about it? That's why we ain't leaving no witnesses. There's probably more... Come on, Vito, get in the elevator. You're dead, you slanty-eyed fuck! What is it that you want? <laughs> what the fuck do you think we want? We want to know why you had our friend killed. We also want the money you took from him. I had no choice. Your friend was a government informer. What, what? the fuck are you talking about? A contact inside the Federal Bureau of Narcotics told me that Henry Tomasino passed them information about our deal. That's a fucking lie! Whoa, whoa, whoa. You saying Henry was a rat? Yes. But not anymore. That's bullshit. Makes no sense. And I suppose you had nothing to do with the little stick-up after we closed the deal with you either, right? You think we would take such a stupid risk and destroy our own factory? That was just another reason to get rid of you. We had problems with you from the very beginning. Oh, yeah? Well, all your problems are just about over, pal. So where's our money? It's not here anymore. What?! Where the hell is it, then? I cannot tell you. If you don't tell us, I'm gonna splatter your yellow brains all over this fucking room! If I told you, I'd be dead anyway. Fine. Your choice! <laughs> Are you crazy? What you wanna do, let him go or something? We could've gotten more out of him. Fuck that, he wouldn't have said nothing. These bastards are tough. <sighs> Let's just get the hell out of here before the cops come. Looks like this place won't be opening up for a while. If we had the time, I'd burn it to the damn ground. Vito, come here. Ah, oh, fuck this! Come on, Vito, let's get out of here. There's too many of them. Find us a car, quick! He's a maniac! We gotta take him down! Roger that. This effect is about six feet tall, dark hair, medium build. Ten four. All right, we lost him. Take me to my place, Vito. I need a fucking drink. That was, uh, was fucked up, huh? Yeah. I don't want to talk about it. Just get me back to my place, would you? All right. <clears throat> what the fuck are you doing? What's up your ass today? In the market for something special? I have just the thing. It was a pleasure.
Ah, oh, damn it. Hey, you just went through a red light. Drive like my fucking grandma, do you know that? Nah, it wasn't that bad. It was than abroad. This deal was a total fucking disaster. Tell me about it. Henry's dead. We don't have Bruno's money. We killed half the Tongs. And if they think Carlo sent us, that'll mean war. We're fucked. Yeah. And if Carlo finds out we got him into this mess... What if Henry really was a rat? No fucking way. Don't even say that. Look, first let's get the money for Bruno. That'll fix at least one problem. But I'm done for today. I need a drink. I'll call you in the morning. We'll figure this shit out. All right. Okay, I'll see you later. And Vito, be careful. Sound like I'm ready, you just woke me up. So get the fuck up. We don't get the money for Bruno today. We're fucked. Where the hell are we gonna get our hands on 55 grand, huh? I don't know. We sure as hell ain't gonna find it laying around in bed. I got something for starters. A job from Eddie with a big payout. No shit? Yeah, I'll pick you up in a few minutes. So get dressed, grab a gun, and wait for me outside. I'll tell you more in the car. This better not be one of your brilliant ideas, Joe. Hey, I'm not in the mood. Sorry, sorry. Didn't mean to snap at you. I'm still half asleep over here. Yeah, yeah, whatever. So you in or not? Sure, why not? How long till you get here? I'm calling from the gun shop around the corner. I'll be at your place in a minute. All right, I'll wait for you out back. I'll see you soon. Hey, what's with the fancy wheels? Eddie gave it to us just for this job. Nice, eh? You drive. My head's still pounding from last night. We're going to Greenfield. Guess you hit the sauce pretty hard, too, huh? Yeah, I couldn't sleep either. Nothing a bottle of scotch couldn't fix, though. Head over to Greenfield. Oh, man, what the fuck are you doing? All right. So now can you tell me what this is all about? We're just gonna drive there, pop some guy, and drive away. Should be a piece of cake. Why? Eddie said it's a favor for some family from another city. Unfinished business. He gave me this envelope with all the instructions. Said it's gotta be clean, and it's gotta be done today. Why the hell doesn't the other family just do it themselves? Eddie said they've been looking for this guy for a while, and he just found him. They're afraid that if it ain't done right away, the guy's gonna disappear again. Here, here's a picture of him. What'd this guy do? Says here he ratted his family out to the feds. Guy's got to come and do that. But wait a minute. If he cooperated with the feds, that means he was under protection, right? What if he still is? Even if he is, we're getting paid a few grand for the job. So it's more than worth the risk. Man, if you say so. 
Hey, we need every penny we can get right now, right? So, after we finish this job, we'll split up and look for other work. All right. Says here they want us to give him a message before we do it. Here, here it is. Okay, got it. Hey, and if you see Eddie later, not a word about yesterday. We was never there. Last chink we saw was delivering egg foo young. You get it? Yeah, what do you think I am? Some kind of retard? Jury's still out on that one, pal. Just making sure you don't slip up, that's all. Did you not see that light turn red? I know how to drive, all right? Remember what you gotta say? Yeah. All right, here we go then. Mr. Angelo? Uh, yes? Mr. Salieri sends his regards. Like I said, it's about six feet tall. Not Dark so hair, fast. Look, medium build. Those guys over there. Shit! Go, Roger go! That. Let's get the fuck out we of here! We got a homicide here. Suspect is armed. This is Agent Cox. We need police support in Greenfield. Now, goddammit! Those were feds. That asshole really was under protection. And he's famous for conveniently leaving out little details like that. Maybe he didn't know. Don't matter now. We gotta lose him. Fuck, that was close. Get me to Kingston, will you? I got a car waiting there. What about the money? Hey, I almost forgot. Eddie paid me in advance, so here's your share.
only the finest attire for a man such as yourself. It was a pleasure. What do you got, an aversion to red lights? Put off the accelerator. Take it easy. I'm in a rush. Good luck getting your hair for the money. Come by my place when you're done. Okay. I'll see you later.
pursuit of a speeding vehicle. Copy that. Hey, thanks for coming by. I knew I could count on you. What for? <clears throat> Frank's organizing a sit-down with the other bosses, and he took almost all my guys as bodyguards. So I don't have nobody around to handle this here job for me. Derek, these guys still don't want to work. What? Why? Because of that deadbeat you fired. Hey. Shit. Well, Vito, that other thing will have to wait. Can you help us out here with this first? What's happening? Well, this deadbeat didn't come to work for a whole week. Pretended he was sick. Total bullshit. So I fired his ass. Anyway, some of his buddies are upset, and they're threatening to strike. All I gotta do is show up with a few guys who look like they mean business. That'll scare them, and they'll forget all about it. I give you a thousand bucks. Are you in? All right. I ain't gonna say no to that kind of money. All right. All you need to do is stand behind me and look tough. Right, Steve? We'll see. These fucking guys really think who the fuck they are. This ain't the first time I have problems with them, you know. You uh, know how many of them there is? Three, four, ten. How the fuck should I know? Does it matter? Oh, no, it's just, uh, what are we gonna do to them? All depends on how the, uh, labor negotiations go. Just let me do all the talking. I don't need just opening your mouths and proving how stunages are. So, what's the problem here, fellas? We want you to give Big John his job back. It's me that decides who gets hired and fired around here. And I say he's fired. All we're asking is for you to hire him back. He's got a family. He needs a job. I've made my decision. See, I told you! Easy does it, Vinny. We want to do this Easy. peacefully. We bust our asses day in and day out for this fat fuck! And if anything ever happens to us, he'll screw us over Blow just like your he did John. now, young man. I don't want to hear another word about that fucking dead. Who are you calling a deadbeat? A crate fell on the poor guy while he was working. For you, broke both his damn hands. Well, that's his fucking problem, not mine. And I suggest you just get back to work before somebody else's hands get you broke. You goddamn bastard! You fellas are really starting to piss me off. There's no need for violence. Please, put it down. We don't want no trouble. It don't look that way to me. Right now, looks like you got big trouble, don't you? Now, if you all don't want to start looking for new jobs, you'll be back to work in the next ten minutes. You see, Vito, all they do is bitch and moan. Vito? You're Skeletor's boy, ain't you? I, your dad used to talk about you all the time. You look just like him. But what are you doing working for this bastard? After what he did to your old Shut man? Shut your fucking mouth right now. Don't listen to him, Vito. He's full of shit. Come on, let's go. Full of shit, huh? That bastard killed your father, Vito. What? They're just trying to get under your skin, Derek. Hey, stop pointing that gun Why at me. Why don't you ask him how your dad drowned Trap. that night? We seen him take a walk with Steve. And then Steve come back alone. And all wet. Stop pointing that thing at me. What the hell happened with my father, Derek? Are you nuts or what? Who are you gonna trust, me or these now unemployed losers? We known each other for a long time, Vito. Think of all Why the things. Were you all wet, Steve? You dive in and try to save him? Because he wouldn't stay underwater. Come out, shut! Vito, you swore an oath. I was there. Our loyalty to the family is greater than to our own families. Tell that to my mother. <sighs> Should I kill him? No, not here. We'll settle things with him later.
You disappoint me, Vito. You really do. I'm gonna do a hell of a lot more than disappoint you, Derek. Your dad. Not right now. I gotta get that fuck before he runs away. Time to teach that fat fuck a lesson. Vinny, where'd you get that? Doesn't matter. 